Hello everyone, register for the webinar with MP Arnold Viersen tonight. Stats and facts about COVID and defending girls. It is Wednesday, January 20th, and this is Quick Updates. Now this evening, I am pleased to be joined by MP Arnold Viersen for two webinars. Here are the times, one for Eastern Canada and one for Western Canada. We'll be discussing the topic of sexual exploitation, explicit sexual online materials, human trafficking, and its connection with the recent Pornhub developments. We'll talk about what's been going on, what we hope will transpire in the next couple of weeks, and how you can get involved to bring about positive change. Go to arpacanada.ca slash webinar to register for tonight's webinar and your preferred time. Now, Levi compiled a COVID-19 fact sheet that was published to our website this week. Hi, everyone. We're nine months into the COVID-19 pandemic here in Canada, and we still get often conflicting reports of what COVID is like, how many cases there are, how deadly it is. And so to help all of Reformed Christians in Canada understand the facts around COVID, we've come up with a COVID-19 fact sheet that you can use to help understand what the virus is like and help inform your decisions, your daily to day lives. So we encourage you to go on ARCA's website, go check it out, and we hope that it'll be a blessing to you. Back to you, Colin. Thanks, Levi. Next, Tabitha joins us to talk about Bill C-233. Thanks, Colin. So last February, MP Kathy Wagenthal introduced the Sex Selective Abortion Act. This is a huge moment for the pro-life movement as it's the first time in about 15 years that Parliament has an actual piece of abortion legislation to debate. Now, because of COVID, everything got delayed with that bill, but we're really hoping and optimistic that that bill will be debated this spring. So this is a great time to sit down and write to your MP, make sure they know that you support this bill, and stay tuned for other action items related to this. Back to you, Colin. Thanks so much, Tabitha. For prayer requests this week, we're asking you to pray about these three federal bills. First, please pray that the Senate would vote against Bill C-7, which expands euthanasia. Two, please pray that the churches and Christian communities would become aware of Bill C-6 on so-called conversion therapy and the concerns that bill brings for biblical Christian counseling. And third, please pray for Bill C-233 on sex-selective abortions, that it would make good progress through the House this year. That's it for quick updates this week. Thanks to you for watching. Please do like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.